Ukraine launched its biggest ever drone attack on Moscow on Tuesday. But all eight drones were destroyed by its air defences. One politician branded it the worst attack on the capital since World War II. The incident coincided with the latest wave of airstrikes on Kiev, marking a moment where both capitals were hit on the same day. Some of Moscow's most prestigious areas were reportedly hit by drone debris, including Leninsky Prospect, a grand avenue crafted under Joseph Stalin, and an elite area of western Moscow, where President Vladimir Putin has a residence. The capital's mayor said two people were injured and one hospitalized in the early morning attack. A Ukrainian official denied Kiev's involvement in the Moscow attack, but said Ukraine was enjoying watching the strike and forecast more to come. Across the border, Kiev was hit on Tuesday for the third time in 24 hours and for the 17th time in May. Ukrainian defense forces said they shot down more than 20 Iranian-made Shahed drones. Kiev's mayor, Vitaly Klitschko, responded to the attack. Putin need Ukraine without Ukrainians. It's terrorism. It's uh, everyone, yes, of course, uh, worry about that. And uh, Russians want to bring depression to our people. Instead, depression, people very angry. Officials said at least one person died and others were injured when debris from a destroyed Russian projectile hit a high-rise apartment building, causing a fire. Ukraine is promising a counteroffensive backed with Western weapons to try to drive Russian occupiers from seized territory. Moscow says it is open to resuming stalled peace talks with Kiev and has welcomed mediation efforts from Brazil and China. But Kiev insists full withdrawal of Russian troops is the only way to end the war.